Hi, I'm Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to input a polynomial into Excel. This is something that's very common in math. Polynomials are used in many places in math and, and science. So I have a spreadsheet set up here and I have an X in this column and over here I'm going to put in the formula for Y and I've just written out, this is just a text box up here showing what the polynomial function is that I'm going to enter in. So what we do is anytime you enter a formula into Excel, you click on the cell and then you type equals and then you just, um, in this case it's almost exactly what we have up there. Any formula in Excel starts with an equals, so we type equals and then we type 30, pretty much just the way it's written up there, plus and then 10 times and then we just click on the first X here and it will enter in the cell reference which it's in, it's in cell B4 but if you just click on it, it Excel knows that you want to enter in that value in that cell right there and then we just keep going we go, to, we go plus 5 times and then um, now the formula bar is covered over where we would like to click so we're just going to type in B4 we had to cheat a little there and then the exponent is this the um, the caret symbol above the 6 is, is used for an exponent so it's that's that value squared and then plus 2 times and then it's B4 and the exponent symbol and 3 and then hit return and there we go that's the value now we can do a little test here if X is 0 then this term and this term and this term are all 0 and the answer is just simply 30 so now, finally, to copy the formula down to these other cells, what you do is you move your cursor until it becomes a solid plus sign at the bottom right of the cell, hold your mouse button down, and just drag down, and that copies the formula into all these cells where each one now refers to the corresponding cell to the left of it. So I hope this has been helpful. I'm Ted, and today I showed you how to input a polynomial into Excel. Thanks for watching.